Hi folks, this is Vince with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and today we're going to take a first look at The Hive. This is a game that you can find on Steam's Early Access program for about 20 bucks. It's important to stress that, Early Access. That means the game is still under development, so everything that you're about to see is subject to change. Here's a look at the main menu. Continue, New Game, Load Game, Options. Under Options, you've got Graphics, Sound, and Gameplay tabs. Under Graphics, Master Volume, Music, Advisor, and Unit Volume. I have the music turned off for the sake of the commentary and to prevent copyright issues. Uh, graphics, you've got Full Screen, Screen Resolution, V-Sync, and some other things I'm not going to bother reading off. Nothing under Gameplay right now. Okay, so let's just go ahead and try this out and see if I like it. It's important to note I have not played this before, I just got my press key today. So this is going to be a first impressions video. I'll be learning as I go. We thought we wielded the power of the gods. We thought we were immortal. We were wrong. First came the reign of fire, and it was only the harbinger of a greater threat. Our technology was useless. For the first time in history, the Earth was united for a common goal, for survival. The construction of a massive colony ship began, the only hope for our future. Sacrifices were unavoidable. Only the sharpest and strongest of people could be chosen for the journey. The task took no less than three years, yet the inevitable impact was already near. In 2178, the world ended. We could only watch as billions of lives vanished in the blink of an eye. The earth was swallowed in flames. The search for a new home began. A search that would take a human lifetime. Most of the people were preserved in cryogenic sleep to wait for our new reign. But finally our long journey came to an end. We arrived at the edge of a suitable solar system. Within it, we found the new Eden. The weather was harsh and sandstorms raged on the planet's surface, allowing only the survival of the strongest of species. But deep underground, sleeping in the city of ancients, there were fountains teeming with new life. And there, a new species awoken to explore the unknown world. Alright, looks pretty interesting. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, take a look at what we're getting into here. Arise, who creates one? The dawn of our empire is at hand. Okay, so it looks like we're actually taking on the role of these creatures. So I don't know if the humans will be coming into play later, or if there's going to be battles between the two. I have no idea. It'll be interesting, though. This thing's taking its good old time. We are shadow without form. Shape us. Okay, so just then looking at the interface, bottom left-hand corner is the mini-map. Uh, upper right-hand corner, objectives, build a hive. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. Uh, typical RTS controls from the looks of it. Build menu in the bottom right-hand corner. Alright, we'll just throw that there. I don't know where the resources are, but I'm assuming the game will tell us. All right, in the meantime, let's go ahead and check everything else out. Looks like there's some... They don't look like humans. It must be some other form of life on this planet. All right. You have done well. We require food to thrive. Flesh of these creatures will satisfy our hunger. Interesting. Okay, so how do we get that? Order a worker to kill a turtle and gather its meat. Okay, so there are turtles on distant planets. Good to know. Worker. Additional food required. Okay, so uh, basic worker unit costs 10 food. It looks like food is a resource in this game along with minerals. There's the population and then DNA. I'm not sure what the DNA does. Okay, so we have one worker. Let's go ahead and have it go after that, I guess. Is that what this is? Yeah, it's a turtle. And they attack back, apparently. Alright, 
right, so now we're gathering food. What the heck is that thing? It just keeps going back and forth. I wonder... Let me stop gathering for a moment just to see what's going on here. Is it... Okay, nothing's happening. All right. Yeah, I'm wondering what the, where this bug came from. It, it just okay. Now there's two of them. It's very strange. Oh, I know what's going on. Okay, so basically this 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 worker here is turning this turtle into edible meat, I guess, and then these workers, or whatever these things are, are coming out, uh, coming out of the hive and bringing this food back. It's interesting. Okay. So now I should have enough for another worker. Let's go ahead and do that. Hive Queen. Heavy support unit. Used to enhance friendly creatures' durability and attack damage. We don't have enough food for that yet. Alright, so there's the second worker. Um, let's go ahead and... How much is left to harvest? Well, let's just attack something else. Let's, let's uh, go after this thing over here. Get more food. So I have the ability to attack, move, stop, and hold. Okay. Down here. Retreat to hive. Okay. Alright, so there we go. Starting to build up some food. We've got 51 there. Um... Looks like our build options are limited. Oh, spawn three workers. Let's go ahead and get another worker going then. All kinds of creatures lurk in the darkness, waiting to consume us. This cannot be. Build us barracks and a suitable army. Alright, so we're going to build a barracks now. So this game sort of reminds me of, uh, you know, like, Warcraft 2 and 3, a little bit, but with bugs. What with the different barracks and... I mean, if you're, if you're familiar with a typical RTS, then... It, it seems like you'd be able to jump right into this without a problem. Alright, that's done. Spawn one squad of legionnaires and hunters. That's 50 food and hunters 50 food. Okay, so we're queuing up some units now. Um, what are these other buildings? Worker den can be used to store resources, used to upgrade units and buildings. Sort of like an Age of Empires, I guess. Uh, turret defensive. Oh, that's, I like turrets. We require more materials. Oh, we need minerals for that. Okay, we don't have any minerals for the worker den or for the turret. So how do we get minerals? Enemy, our passage beyond is blocked. The door mechanism needed to open it is located near the catacombs. Ancient terror guards this unholy place. Light will consume it. Light the torches. Okay then. So I guess we're sending these guys over here. I assume. Hopefully they're strong enough to take these guys on here. They look rather nasty. There's a bit of company heroes in this game, too, uh, with the sense that they're squads.
looks like we unlocked something there. Let's go check it out. Okay, so those are the minerals. Okay, I see. Alright, so now using that, pick up the key and open the door to the next area. Did I get the key or not? How do I know if I've gotten it? Is there a way to look at my inventory? I have a shell bug. Dissolve for 20 DNA. I don't know what's up with that. Okay. Is there anything in here? No? All right, well, maybe we've picked it up. Maybe we haven't. One thing I would like to be able to do is click on... Okay, there we go. All right, for whatever reason, I couldn't do it before, but now I seem to be able to. All right. Let's go ahead and send these guys back to our hive. Ah, oh, there's a mineral vein here as well, so I'm wondering if I'll be able to mine that as well. All right, do we have a free worker button? That would be really useful. Doesn't look like we have one. Let's see if we can mine it with this worker here. Looks like it. Okay. Now how do we reinforce? Is there a way to do that? Okay, it doesn't look like I am able to. In Company Heroes, you could uh, retreat to your hive and then... Let's, let's try it. Well, not high, but you could retreat to your headquarters and then reinforce your troops, but it doesn't look like I'm able to do that here. Alright. Alright, let's see if this is open now. Okay, it'll work. Alright. Strange power hums in the air. I can feel it. Tread carefully. I may want to consider building more units, too. Uh, kill the Guardians. Alright, um... Let's see if we can build ourselves... A worker den, just to see what that looks like. And I would also like to build... Are they still... Yeah, they're still going after food. Okay, I'd also like to build... Well, uh, the turret... I guess I could do without the turret. Let's go ahead and get more Legionnaires and more Hunters queued up. We can set rally points from the looks of it. Useful. Alright, so with this, attack upgrade level 1 increases the attack damage of your insoid, I insectoid units. I guess we'll take... Oh, that's, that costs DNA. Oh, okay. So, how do we get DNA then? That's interesting. There's this shell bug. An inferior uh, armored insect native to the underground is offered. So, it looks like I can dissolve different things that I pick up for DNA, but I can also equip it which I don't think I've gotten to in the tutorial yet. Alright, so let's just go ahead and just follow directions. Let's go ahead and kill these guardians here. Protectors of the long dead temple cities. Once rulers of the underworld. Now, just a whisper in the wind. And their eternal watch. We have other uses for them. Alright. Hopefully this little fighting force here is enough. If not, then we'll have to spawn some more. We are under Let's try a hive queen. We Let's retreat for the moment. I don't think we have enough for this. Well, looks like they're coming after us anyway. That's alright. We, we have some reinforcements now. This 
Poor guy back here still fighting. Preparing a ritual. Alright, well, let's pick this stuff up first. Alright, so do we want to go... No, we want to go down or up? Okay, we want to go up. Alright, so what's down here, though? It doesn't... Like, sh should I be going down here for whatever reason? Alright, well, let's just follow directions, move to the altar, and start the ritual. In the meantime, we do have some other units that could help us out. I'm going to go ahead and bring them forward. Yeah, the story on this is very strange, I gotta say. Alright, so I guess we're moving back down... ...this way. In the meantime, we'll go ahead and attack with these guys. Soften them up a bit. And let's go ahead and spawn a few more creatures. Doesn't look like we can. Alright. Are we out of food? Is that why? Yeah, it looks like it. Let's go ahead and kill another one of these turtles. That's what we do. Oh, my worker's almost dead. Okay, that's not good. So now that we're getting more food, we can spawn some more creatures. I don't think we'll need to, though. I mean, it looks like we've got plenty of help right here. The Ancient has slept in the shadows for millennia, watching as the other races evolved and vanished, waiting. It holds something of great value to us, knowledge of things long dead. Secrets of this world. Slay it and consume the essence. Soon we will have all the answers. This doesn't look like it'd be an easy fight, tell you the truth. Um, hopefully we have enough to take it down. Alright, well let's let's go after it. Hopefully we'll have enough. If not, we'll have to spawn some more. We are under attack! Okay. 
Alright, let's go ahead and send these guys down to help. Come on. I guess I can't click on the mini-map. That sucks. Alright, let's retreat for the time being. Hopefully he does not automatically regenerate health. That would stink. Alright, so we're just going to sit here for the time being. Chill out. Let these guys come in. Uh, it looks like we have... Yeah, let's go ahead and do another hunter. Alright. Yeah, luckily it's not regenerating health, so I can build up my forces again and try it. Oh, nice. I can equip different things on this Hive Queen, I guess? Is that what this is all about? Can I equip it down here? No? Okay. I'm sure I'll find that out in a future tutorial. Alright, here comes some more hunters. Alright, we should have enough now to kill it. Hopefully. Maybe. Alright, let's let's keep the Hive Queen back. Just so it's not taking damage. <laughs> Doesn't seem to be able to move, so I can just take it out with this. Oh, never mind. It's moving. A few more hits ought to do it. Aw, oh, come on, really? How did my mission fail? I don't understand that. I, I was just about to kill it. That's weird. Okay, so uh, there you have it, the Hive. Um, it seems like your basic RTS game. It's not a bad game, um, but it definitely has a little bit more work that needs done on it. Uh, if you guys want to see more gameplay videos, let me know. If you haven't already, subscribe to my YouTube channel and check out my official website, www.dadsgamingaddiction.com. This is Vince. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.